Sumatriptan is a medication commonly used to treat migraines and cluster headaches. It belongs to a class of drugs known as triptans, which work by narrowing blood vessels in the brain and reducing inflammation, thereby relieving migraine symptoms. Migraines are neurological disorders that cause severe headaches, often accompanied by nausea, vomiting, and sensitivity to light and sound. Sumatriptan is designed to provide relief by targeting the underlying mechanisms that contribute to migraines. It is available in various forms, including tablets, nasal sprays, and injections, making it a versatile option for different patient needs. One of the main benefits of Sumatriptan is its ability to provide rapid relief from migraine attacks when taken at the onset of symptoms. Many patients experience significant improvement within two hours of taking the medication. The injectable form often works even faster, with some individuals feeling relief in as little as 10 to 15 minutes. This quick action is crucial for those who suffer from debilitating migraines that interfere with daily activities. Additionally, Sumatriptan can reduce the likelihood of migraines returning within 24 hours, helping patients regain productivity and normalcy. Another advantage is its effectiveness for cluster headaches, a rare but extremely painful condition characterized by recurrent, short-lived headaches that occur in clusters over weeks or months. Sumatriptan injections are particularly useful for these headaches, providing relief within minutes. Despite its benefits, Sumatriptan is not suitable for everyone and comes with certain risks. One of the main concerns is its effect on blood vessels. Since Sumatriptan constricts blood vessels, it is not recommended for individuals with cardiovascular conditions such as coronary artery disease, high blood pressure, or a history of stroke. Using Sumatriptan in such cases can increase the risk of serious cardiovascular events, including heart attacks. Patients with risk factors such as smoking, obesity, diabetes, or a family history of heart disease should consult their healthcare provider before using Sumatriptan. Another potential risk is medication overuse headaches. Frequent use of Sumatriptan can lead to rebound headaches, where migraines become more frequent and severe due to the body's dependence on the medication. To avoid this, healthcare providers recommend limiting Sumatriptan use to no more than 10 days per month. If a patient experiences frequent migraines requiring more frequent medication, doctors may suggest preventive treatments instead. Side effects of Sumatriptan can vary depending on the individual and the form of the medication used. Common side effects include dizziness, drowsiness, nausea, dry mouth, and a sensation of tingling or warmth. Some patients may experience more serious side effects such as chest pain, tightness in the throat, or shortness of breath. In rare cases, Sumatriptan can cause serotonin syndrome, a potentially life-threatening condition resulting from excessive serotonin levels in the brain. This risk is higher for individuals taking other medications that affect serotonin, such as selective serotonin reuptake inhibitors, or SSRIs or serotonin norepinephrine reuptake inhibitors, also known as SNRIs. Patients should always inform their healthcare provider of any other medications they are taking to prevent harmful drug interactions. The method of administration also plays a role in how well sumatriptan works and its potential side effects. The tablet form is widely used and convenient, but it may take longer to provide relief compared to the nasal spray or injection. The nasal spray is a good option for individuals who have trouble swallowing pills or experience nausea with migraines. The injectable form offers the fastest relief, making it ideal for severe cases, but some patients may find injections uncomfortable or intimidating. Sumatriptan should only be used when a migraine or cluster headache attack occurs, rather than as a preventive treatment. If a patient finds that their migraines are frequent or persistent, doctors may recommend alternative treatments such as beta blockers, antidepressants, anti-seizure medications, or lifestyle modifications to reduce migraine frequency. Patients should also be aware of certain triggers that can make migraines worse, including stress, lack of sleep, dehydration, certain foods, and hormonal changes. Keeping a migraine diary to track symptoms and triggers can help patients and their doctors develop a more effective treatment plan. For individuals considering Sumatriptan, it is important to follow their healthcare provider's instructions carefully. 
Taking too much of the medication can increase the risk of serious side effects, while taking too little may not provide adequate relief. Patients should also be aware of the timing of doses, as taking sumatriptan too late into a migraine attack may reduce its effectiveness. If a patient does not respond well to sumatriptan, alternative triptans such as rizotriptan, zolmatriptan, or elatriptan may be considered, as some individuals respond better to different triptans. Insurance coverage and cost can also be a concern for some patients. Sumatriptan is available in both brand name and generic forms, with the generic version generally being more affordable. However, the cost can still vary depending on the patient's insurance plan and pharmacy. Some manufacturers offer discount programs or patient assistance programs to help reduce the cost of the medication. Patients who struggle with affordability should discuss options with their doctor or pharmacist to find the most cost-effective solution. In conclusion, Sumatriptan is a highly effective medication for treating migraines and cluster headaches, providing rapid relief for many patients. However, it is important to use it correctly and be aware of potential risks, including cardiovascular concerns, medication overuse headaches, and possible side effects. Patients should work closely with their healthcare providers to determine if Sumatriptan is the right choice for them and to explore alternative treatments if needed. By understanding how Sumatriptan works and following medical guidance, individuals can manage their migraines more effectively and improve their quality of life.